Man, we are cruising tonight. We we're gonna get home early enough to watch Desperate Housewives. Oh, this is exciting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome two-time Academy Award winner, Dustin Hoffman. Good evening. So the saying goes, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Well, when you adapt material from a novel or a short story or some other source, you have to take something that works, and then you have to break it, and then you have to fix it, and then you have to turn it into a film that works. And that ain't easy. The nominees for Best Screenplay almost opened it. <laughs> it's so much easier to act than do this stuff. <laughs> Great work. I'm looking at everybody who didn't win. Great work, you people. Great work. Come on. <laughs> Sorry. Excuse me. I'll never get invited again. <laughs> the nominees for Best Screenplay based on material previously produced or published are... Larry McMurtry and Diana Osana for Brokeback Mountain based on the short story by Annie Pooh. Dan Futterman for Capote based on the book by Gerald Clark. Jeffrey Kane for The Constant Gardener based on the novel by John Le Carre. Josh Olson for A History of Violence, based on the graphic novel by John Wagner and Vince Locke. Tony Kushner and Eric Roth for Munich, based on the book Vengeance, the true story of an Israeli counter-terrorist team by George Jonas. And the Oscar goes to Larry McMurtry, Diana Osana for Brokeback Mountain. This is the first Academy Award and second nomination for Larry McMurtry. He was previously nominated for The Last Picture Show. This is the first Academy Award and second nomination tonight for Diana Osana. She's also nominated in the Best Picture category. Thank you to the Academy. The duty of art is to send light into the darkness of men's hearts. Thank you, Annie Prue. She's right over there for trusting us with your brilliant short story. Thank you to Ang Lee and our brilliant cast for breathing life into our words. Thank you to Universal Focus Features, Bill Polad, Michael Costigan, my dear friend, uh, my good friend Mark Poirier for giving me The New Yorker that had that short story in it. And thank you to my writing partner, Larry. And thank you for giving him this award as well. Since somehow I unaccountably failed to thank my brilliant partner, Diana, at the Golden Globes, I'm going to rattle off all the attributes I was going to thank her for at the Golden Globes. Smarts, guts, drive, good judgment, tenacity, loyalty, and generosity. That's the kind of virtues you need in the rough strife of movie making. I'd like to thank also James and Curtis, my son and grandson, with love and pride. Thank our loyal lawyers, Robert Thorne and Greg Redlitz, and finally, I'm going to thank all the booksellers of the world. Remember that Brokeback Mountain was a book before it was a movie. Uh, from the humblest paperback exchange to the masters of the great bookshops of the world, all are contributors to the survival of the culture of the book, a wonderful culture which we mustn't lose. Thank you.